Do you know what time it is? Right now, it's Tara time. And I'm here to tell you about my own show idea called Make It Happen. This show concept is so important to me because I feel like everyone needs to be reminded at this point in time, especially with the economy and the recession hitting everyone so hard, of the American dream. And anything is possible if you put some work into it and figure out exactly what it is you want. Stay home with your kids and work from home. Start your own company like I did. As a survivor of the recession myself, after being laid off, I decided after seven years planning events and in the event industry to really launch my own company to help people realize the good things in life. Live your life. It's, a, it's about figuring out who you are. And on that journey, you have a good darn time. <laughs> My first guest today is Todd Avila. He's a stand-up comedian who just recently moved to Los Angeles from Fresno, California. Thank you for being with us, Todd. Thank you for having me. So, Todd, let's start it off. Who or what inspires you? I try to inspire myself. Right. Um, I try to set that bar every day. and. Uh, because if you don't believe it, then nobody else is going to believe it either. How the recession actually affected you personally in your life and career? You know, um, in 07 I got laid off, like a lot of other people did. Mm -hmm. And uh, when you're sitting at home for four months, lets the wheels start turning. And, uh, you know, you get to kind of think about where you're going and what direction you're taking. And uh, so it kind of affected me in the way that I was broke for a while. Um, although I never had to go on unemployment, I was lucky that it was only a four month span and I was able to find work quickly after that but uh, it is possible it is possible but you have to you know you have to be motivated to say you know I don't want to sit at home I want to do something um, I don't like sitting at home and doing nothing mm -hmm. um, that's what the weekends are for right <laughs> how did you figure out what job you would enjoy and be successful at well since I'm not good at any jobs <laughs> I knew that pretty much um, the only way I was going to be successful is to do something that I enjoyed doing. <laughs> My next guest is a hardworking mother of three who combined the two things that she really had a passion for, vintage jewelry and photography. And we're here in Costa Mesa, California today with entrepreneur Janet Brown. Hi. Huh? What struggles and challenges have you faced, especially during these economic times, that have made you forge ahead and take matters into your own hands and run these two companies on your own? We uh, find it challenging living in Orange County, raising three kids, owning our own business, and I wanted to really uh, take care of my kids myself and not have them be in daycare and you know, here, there, and everywhere. Um, well, there you have it. Some motivated people with inspirational stories.